Alright, what's up guys and welcome to Modern Warfare 3 Zombies. So I want to take a little bit break from the multiplayer mastery camo grind and come over and check out the brand new zombies DMZ like mode here in Modern Warfare 3. It seems like some people really like this mode, other people like the OG zombie guys prefer the round base like myself i also prefer like the round base i just think it's better i've been seeing everybody talk about zombies and i kind of wanted to hop on feel it out for myself because eventually i'm gonna be playing it anyway i'm gonna end up grinding this mastery camo grind as well as the multiplayer one just like the multiplayer camo grind where you have gold platinum priceless and the interstellar over here we actually have an entire zombie camo grind as well we have golden enigma zy Zircon scale I can't read serpentine and then lastly borealis which this camo looks incredibly clean I want it yeah so I figured we hop on experience zombies for the first time and unlock our very first golden enigma weapon so we just need to get 250 basic zombie kills 10 kills within five seconds 10 times 250 kills while on tax stance and then 200 critical kills and then lastly we have to get 100 kills while successfully extract with the holger 556 in a single deployment should be pretty simple you think if I'm wearing the zombies skin that I'll just blend in with the zombies and they won't know it's me. I feel like I'd be like the Shaun of the Dead clip where they're pretending to be zombies and going... Aah. I've seen a little bit of stuff about this zombies and from what I've heard playing this as solo it actually can get quite difficult and that playing it in a full squad is the way to do it. But listen, like socializing ew i know there's like a tier one low difficulty tier then there's like a tier two with a little bit harder zombies and then a tier three which i'm assuming is probably where like the boss is or some gigantic uh you know creature i i think i'm gonna go to it to be honest doi visit nice operation deadbolt modern warfare zombies here is modern warfare three zombies it's pretty much just dmz like yeah if we open up the map yeah you got the entire i think this is the new war zone map i'm not entirely sure okay, so it looks like the edges of the map is like the low tier i'm assuming this orange is probably tier two where it's a little bit harder of zombies and then red is i'm assuming where like the big boys are yeah i have no idea what i'm doing but i'm just gonna go get kills figure it out so i just have to get normal kills critical kills and then i believe tax stamp kills oh look at this zombie hi how are you hey, what's up zombie critical kill nice what is this hidden loot cache oh we found a shotgun no, no, hey, yo, I want my weapon back. Yo, what the f was that jump? Oh, wait, I saw an Easter egg with these little things. If you fly through all three of those rings, apparently you get a perk. I'm gonna go do it. Boom. Oh, light armored zombies. Oh my god, wait. He's level two. Oh, what's up? What is this? What the f Oh, is there AI in this? Somebody just got beat down by a question mark. Okay, I'm... Yeah, no. I don't know what's going on. Yeah, so I've briefly looked over the Zombies camo grind for Mod Warfare 3. I'm gonna be honest. All the other camo grinds, like, were kind of intimidating. Dark Ether and Cold War was a little bit intimidating. Vanguards, I mean, I didn't even touch Vanguard zombies. Like, I think I got maybe one weapon just because of how, like, massive the grind was. Now, considering we have both the Mod Warfare 2 and the Mod Warfare 3 weapons for, like, zombie mastery camos, it is gonna be a lot. But comparing this grind to other games... I don't think it's going to be that bad. All right, so I'm supposed to jump through here, go through that ring, that ring, and that ring, and I should get some kind of reward. I saw this on TikTok. Maybe I get lied to. Okay. Okay, we angle this. Oh, there's a dog down there. Entering new zone, medium threat. Hey, listen, I'm just trying to do an Easter egg. Boom. I do it. Boom. Reward lift. This is cool. Death perception. Gotcha. Oh my god. Dude, these zombies coming out of nowhere. They're super quiet. Do they have the covert sneakers on? Did you guys get the converse as well? Oh my god. I oh my god, I am almost about to go down. And another critical kill. Let's do it. Also, there is a timer for this mode. So just like normal DMZ, eventually you do have to extract. Like you can't just sit here and infinitely play the one round like you can with like round based zombies. I don't know exactly what happens. I think like the zone gets gas and it starts to condense. And maybe you have to push like deeper and deeper into the game until you get into the tier three where eventually you'll either go down or you'll just extract. Ooh, mystery box. I don't think I have enough cash. What's going on? Boom. Get a couple kills. Look at the way he walks, man. Has a little limp to him. He's gone. Got him. Hello? Who just... Okay. They can open doors. Ooh, what is that? Is that armor? Grab that. Full armor. Nice. 
Yeah, no, this is like actually so easy. Mystery box. Feeling lucky, random weapons, and support. I don't have enough cash for that. Rare ether tool. Consume to upgrade your weapon rarity. Oh, it already upgraded it. My weapon's blue. Okay. Comic book. Medium rucksack. Cool. So our backpack's better. Ooh, what is this? Replay armor vest. Heart locket. Old watch. Nah, I'm good. So personally, first impressions of this mode is it's kind of just zombie DMZ. Outbreak, if you will. Honestly, when I went back and I played Outbreak, I enjoyed the mode. Now, personally, I prefer round-based zombies normal zombies but it's like one of those things where i would rather have this than have no zombies i guess i don't know what the overall community opinion is of this now this honestly can't be you know worse than playing vanguard zombies the first iteration of zombies that we got in vanguard was quite literally like the worst version of zombies i personally ever experienced it was so bad that i got one weapon whatever was like the golden equivalent in zombies and then never touched it again yeah i don't know what i gotta do with that i'll figure it out later maybe you have to get like canned food Chunk of flesh. Wait. Holy. Like, oh, it's a zero. Befriend a hellish companion. Yo, look at this little thing. Haley, is that, his, is that the name? Oh, it's my homie. Let's do this. Yo, come here. Yo, it's good. I love this. I don't. Yeah, no. That sold it for me right there. I wouldn't be surprised though if later down the road, they do add in like an actual round based zombies map to Mod Warfare 3. I mean, because they did it with Vanguard. Vanguard off the rip, everybody was flaming it. Nobody really liked it. And then eventually they added Shino Numa and a couple other like kind of round based zombies maps. Yo, I want to see what this dog does in action. Yo, get these zombies. Sick them, boy. Oh my God, that was nice. All right, what we got here? Full power. Nice. At the end of the day, in about a year's time, Treyarch will be dropping their game. Odds are they'll definitely have a round-based zombies map, if not a couple, on the launch of whatever Treyarch comes out with. So, yeah. If this is what we got to play for a little bit, you know, so be it. My dog's fighting these zombies by himself. Oh, my God. I can play this in third person? I just like this even more now. Entering the Orlov military base. Come on, Haley. Boop, 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 boop. Pop. Get 100 critical kills. Man, we are flying through this challenge. Looking, wait, invite sent. Look for players. I didn't, I did not want to invite anybody. That's my, okay. Thought I killed my dog first. Oh my God, I'm actually going down. Oh my God, help, help me, help me. Where's my dog? So the total challenges that we need is get 250 kills, 10 kills in five seconds, 10 times, 250 kills with tag stance and 200 critical kills. So we've gotten the 100 kill challenge to pop up. 100 crit kills to pop up and i'm assuming we're probably almost done getting the you know 10 kills in five seconds or whatever if not we'll get that in the end when we're exfilling because i do know when you exfil a ton of zombies spawn right now the plan that i want to do is i want to get i believe it's 5,000 uh cash and then i want to go and upgrade and pack a punch this holger just so i can go into tier two is there any missions that we can do raid weapon stash yeah let's go do that uh, i have already been in this for like 10 minutes and i've done like nothing how do you die on this they have to be in like the tier three zone because like i just don't see how any one could die of these zombies right here boom oh that's cool contract accepted raid the weapon sash Ooh, and there's a pack a punch near here oh my god my dog's fighting all these zombies out here what did i just do i'm assuming that's just like alerting a lot of zombies oh here's the pack a punch uh i need five thousand. i only have three thousand okay Oh my god, you are really close to me. Get away. Wait, I just realized if I go tax stance right now, I can knock out like all the challenges in one go. Oh, this camo challenge is gonna be so easy. Oh, there's oh my god, that's a lot of zombies. Oh my god, ow. Ow. Perfect. Nice. Okay. Ow. Off. Oh, it's hard to, I just don't know which one's my dog and which one's not a, my dog. Weekly challenge. All right, cool. That's done. Oh, we got a camo challenge done. Get 250 kills, man. This is actually going to be probably the easiest camo grind that I've ever had it done. That I've ever had it done. What kind of English is that, Cameron? 200 critical kills done. Wow, this is actually stupid easy. Now, I already know, like, there's going to be a gun or two that's probably going to have, like, a lot of stupid challenges that's going to take forever. If it's anything like this, I could get behind this grind. Super chill, relaxed grinding, you know, take my headset off, watch a movie while I play games. I love it. Stash unlocked. Ooh, and I have enough cash to pack a punch. Hold up. All right, pack a punch. Cool, and what is it? He's a pack a punch camo too? What is that, like DNA? I like that. Now that I got a pack a punch weapon and two perks, I, I actually kind of want to go into here. Is there a vehicle that I can borrow? What is this? 
Stop moving so much. God damn, bro. Like this thing. How many? Is this thing invincible? Okay, no, it's dead. Orb defeated. Nice little four wheeler. Let's take it. What's up? Ooh. Oh, I'm in the water. This is not good. Go. Go. Movement disabled. No, you can make it. Make. Okay, now these zombies kind of fall over now that I have a pack punch weapon. It's not as bad, but a little bit harder. Ow, can you? Oh my god, they sprint now. Protect the server. I can do that. Oh my god. Oh my god. How long do I have to defend this for? Oh, there's a perk here. Oh, it's quick revive. Don't mind if I do. Is this all this thing does? I'm gonna pet my dog. Hey, come here. You look kind of vicious. Come here. Hey. Haley. Hey, come over here. Let me pet you. Oh, that one's done. I have to go to the next one. Wow, I'm an idiot. Activate seismic refractor. A little speed montage. Just running. All right. Now I just gotta protect this for two and a half minutes. That's fine by me. Shouldn't be too hard, I guess. What the hell? There's people here? Shield soldier. Are you? Oh my god. Man's really running a riot. Shielding zombies? Oh my god. The computer help. What are you? Yo. Bro, what the hell? Uh, what? This is like kind of stressful now. Dude, why? See, that's the thing about a zombie apocalypse is the zombies are never really the problem. It's the people that make it the problem. Yo, what happens if I use my power up? What kind of power up is this? Is that? Uh... Bruh. Did someone save me? Oh, I res myself or something happened. I don't know what just happened. I failed the mission. I'm out. Get, get me out of here. I'm confused. I'm getting out of here. No, I'm out. What's this? Gas mask? What the f*** is in here? Okay, um, it says clear the infest. I'm assuming it's these little things. My gas mask is already wearing out. This is not good. Okay. Go upstairs, maybe? Insta kill, we like that. Okay, my gas mask is almost done. Oh no, this is not good. This is not good. This is not good. What the? F Go. Gotta do this quick. That dead. That dead. Oh my god. My gas mask is off. Oh no, I'm choking. All right, hold up, hold up. Let me gather my breath. Oh my god, ow, these guys hurt. Okay, I really hope I killed them. Oh my god, they hurt! All of this is locked because of the infestation. So if I go up more, hello? Alright, infested. Okay, that's it. That's all we do? Is this hacking? Okay, so I got these chests now. I got another self revive kit. Okay, thanks. I needed as many of those. Oh, I got monkey bombs. I don't think I have this weapon unlocked, so I'm gonna extract with it because I need it. I do know that this version of zombies has two wonder weapons. We have the ray gun and the wonder waffle, which I believe you can just get in the mystery box. But I do know that you can get like a schematic that you're able to actually craft it. And I believe it's like a two day cooldown. That's cool. But watch me get ray gun first try in the box. Legendary 300% bonus damage plus five attachments. What is this? It... Okay, he's dead. He... Okay. They look scarier than they actually are. I'm gonna hit it one more time. I'm feeling lucky. It's gonna be a ray gun. I saw the Wonder Wolf. What is that? Riveters. Oh, it's a shotgun. One more. Give me the Wonder Weapon. Give me the ray gun. That's not the ray gun. All right, one more. I'm feeling really lucky. Right here. This last one. Ray gun. So we only got seven minutes left of this zombie. John Wick just got killed by a question mark. I don't know how that's possible. I don't want to mess with whatever got him. If they got John Wick, I stand literally zero chance. We got seven minutes left of this game. I don't know what happens when, you know, it hits a zero. I don't know if the game just ends. I don't know if like all hell breaks loose and I have to like fight for my life. I'm assuming that's probably it, but 
probably not a bad idea to go and get exfil and i just don't know if i have all my challenges done yet okay so nearest exfil is nearest exfil is right there See, my issue is i don't want to call in the extract right now because if i don't have the final challenge unlocked then all of this okay that's enemies all this will be a waste if i can't get my challenge done it's perfect i'll take advantage of it Oh, it's gone. Oh, you're leaving without me, Poppy? I'm assuming because he just left and we only have two minutes left on this that I should probably also call for an exfil. Where is the nearest exfil? All the way down there. Am I going to be able to make it in time? I don't know if I can make that in time. What happens if the time hits zero? If the game just, if the screen just goes black and I die, I actually will be mad. Got literally one minute to cover a lot of ground. Oh, we're doing pretty good. What is that? Is that a vehicle right there? Oh, that's a lot of enemies but let me just i'm gonna borrow this don't worry about it all right i need it more than you do okay. call an exfil then i make it out in time there we go we got the sack tans kill done one I don't even know if that was English what I just said. Wait, get to the nearest exfil. Okay, so now I'm good. I don't know if I have all the challenges done. Hold on. I don't need a tax stamps kill anymore. Oh, there's a lot of zombies here. Are they trying to jump my dog right now? They are. All right, that's another one. Now we need to get 100 kills before we leave here. I don't know if that's going to be possible, but I'm trying my best. God, there's so many zombies. Oh, and there's an insta kill there. Oh, this is perfect. I got to unlock this so easily. Go, 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 go. Oh my God, this is... Oh my God, there's so many zombies. Oh, uh, nope. This might be, might be bad. I got 15 seconds to get on that plane. Or, that's that, that's a helicopter. There we go. Did I get 100 kills, though? Hop on. Get on. Pick up an extra kill. Imagine if this is the final kill that I needed. All right. Successful exfil. I don't know if I actually played this right at all. Go to my gunsmith. Uh, customize zombies. Oh, we did unlock it this golden enigma camo yeah that is one of many golden weapons for the zombie mastery camo grind overall really easy and super basic like the biggest issue for a lot of people when it comes to like grinding zombie camos is they usually don't grind the multiplayer one first so they have to level up all their weapons considering i already have this weapon gold meaning it's maxed out it was actually incredibly easy to get it gold on zombies and to be fair these challenges were a lot simpler than other ones i think i saw like one weapon where you have to get like kills while having four perks and there's probably one where you got to get pack punch kills and so on and so forth overall incredibly easy that's gonna be it for this video i hope you guys enjoy it. if you guys want to see more modern warfare 3 zombies do me a favor by dropping a like and letting me know down in the comment section that's gonna be all for this video and i'll see you guys in the next one peace